Samsung has to answer some questions. Everyone in the tech community from YouTubers to general consumers to people who actually work in sales and behind the scenes, I've never seen so many people coming together and agreeing on one issue this much. This is a response to the video made by Mr. Who's the Boss talking about the unused Galaxy smartphones blowing up. I feel like sharing my own experience considering I also own a large number of phones as an OG YouTuber of almost 9 years. Recently, the best battery on my Galaxy Z Fold 2 got pregnant. It's swollen so much that the back and the front are almost out. Once again, just like Mr. Who's the Boss and countless other YouTubers, none of this actually happened to any other phone in my collection from Vivo to Xiaomi to Apple to Pixels. It only happened to Samsung phones, particularly to the Galaxy phones that were released after the Note 7. My super old Samsung phones from Galaxy S1 all the way to S6, those are fine. Now here's what you need to know. First up, do not panic if you have a Samsung phone because it's only happening to stored Samsung phones long term. If you're actively using them then it's all good but do not store them especially if you live in hotter regions on earth. There's a very good chance that the batteries will expand. Now the second question is why is this happening? Well we don't know. Only Samsung has to do the research and investigate what is really going on. It probably has to do something with the poor quality control. Samsung is getting its battery from China and apparently from the same supplier as the one who gave them battery for the Note 7, even though these are safe and improved batteries that are not going to have any active issue. But if you're going to store these phones long term unused in your drawer, in hot weather, these are going to expand. And this is exactly what other YouTubers and tech influencers have experienced as well. Now, Mr. Who's the Boss actually got in touch with Samsung where he actually sent those devices to Samsung for some inspection, but he never got any response from them. Samsung definitely has to respond to this publicly, and I'm even here to send my phones for inspection if they require them. Again, I feel like this is something that public should know, and if you're just looking to store a Samsung phone long term for one two years in your drawer definitely don't recommend that let me know your thoughts and experiences in the comment section below with that being said i'll see you guys later peace out